Hi. Today I want to make a little video and just talk about a common, common problem and explain the difference between a $2 conditioner and a $20 treatment. So I've got my jugs here today and I thought rather than just explain it to you, um, I'm going to show you because I feel like people aren't listening to me. And it's annoying me because I want you to listen to me and I want you to take me seriously and I want you to believe that there is a huge difference between buying the cheapest conditioner that you can possibly buy because you don't want to waste money on your hair and spending, say, $20 on a treatment. So the biggest difference is the concentration. So that's what I'm going to show you. And I need you to do treatments if you've colored your hair, if you've got colored damaged hair, your hair needs more than a conditioner can give you. If you've got hair that's been bleached, absolutely you need a treatment. And you're not doing them, people aren't doing them enough. You're not doing them enough. You're doing them like once a month. That's not enough. Um, what I would do is, what I do is I don't use conditioner at all, at all. I use a treatment in replacement of my conditioner. So no more conditioner at all. Treatment all the time. So long as it's just like a moisture treatment, 90% of treatments, you can't overdo them. You can't over treat your hair. So please treat your hair, please. <laughs> you will save yourself so many haircuts just by looking after the condition of your hair. It's not gonna get knotty. It's not gonna feel dry. Like you need, your hair needs more than conditioner. If you've, if you've bleached it, if you've colored it, if you straighten it every day, most of the, most people, I would say 90% of you need treatments instead of conditioner. So just throw your conditioner away, please, and buy a good treatment. Okay, so I'm going to show you this today and this will hopefully change your mind about buying a conditioner. Okay, so I've gone out to the shop and I have bought the cheapest conditioner that I could possibly find, which was $2, okay? Um, and I'm going to show you the difference. So I'm going to get my conditioner here. Well, I can't show you what that is. <laughs> and show you the consistency, okay? So look at this. Can you see how it's very runny? It's very translucent. It's not like a white white. It's foggy looking. And it is just coming out really easily I'm barely even squeezing that bottle okay so it's moving around a lot it's very loose it's very watery so that is conditioner I'm gonna go and get a teaspoon actually so I can show you right so can you see up close how watery that is, how it's like moving around in the spoon and it's shit. <laughs> okay. Now I'm going to show you a treatment. So this is a treatment that I paid $20 for, right? Now watch. It's just in a little pump. Try and make it so you can see. Can you see how thick that is? How that's, sorry, I can't do this with my hands. I'm just going to have to show you as soon as I get it out. But I just want you to see how thick this is. Can you see, can you see that? How it's, it's not even a liquid. It's more like a cream consistency. When we compare this, look at the color, look at the texture. You should be able to do this, okay? This is how I want you to know. When you're going in and you're looking for a treatment to buy, it should be in a tub. Most of the time they're in a tub. I buy mine in bulk, it's like so it's in a pump because it's hairdresser size. So you buy the tub, you take the lid off. If you can see the product, I want you to be able to do this. And nothing comes out. And that's how you know that that is concentrated as shit. So look, so that's my treatment. Can you see? How concentrated this treatment is it's not going anywhere I'm holding it look it is not going anywhere it is concentrated good quality product do you think I could do that with this do you think I'd get no I'm not gonna make a mess no okay so point number one proven you can see the difference now to make even more of a point I'm gonna just aim my camera down now so you can see not my chest but my 
<laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do is get another bit of water. All right, and I'm going to slowly pour the water into the treatment. And I want you to see how much water I've actually got first. So I've got, what have I got? 100 mils of water. And I'm going to pour that into my treatment just to prove a point that this is what you're paying for when you buy a $3 product. Okay, I'll pour a little bit in at a time and I'm going to mix it. I might just fast forward this because this is going to be boring. Right, now, did you see how much water I just put into that treatment? Now look at it. Now it's looking a lot more like the conditioner, isn't it? I'll show you with a teaspoon, okay? This was our treatment before I added a whole bunch of water to it. I probably added about three times the amount of water to it, to what the product actually was. Oh, it looks like conditioner now, doesn't it? That's what you're paying for. I just wanted to make a big point. Okay, $2 conditioner, $20 treatment. Did you see how much water I just put into that? Could you imagine? Could you imagine how many bottles of treatment I could make out of that treatment if I watered it down, mass produced and sold it for $2 a bottle? Why isn't your hair feeling good when you use these products? Why? Like, I, I get annoyed about this, so I just thought, I would just show you that and I hope that that has opened your eyes and you've physically seen how much water that I've just poured into that treatment compared to what it was, which was a nice, thick, concentrated product that's just gone to shit now because I just added all that water in there. Yuck. And yeah, that's your $2 conditioner. So please buy good quality products. <laughs> Bye.